question is for the Minister of Middle Class Prosperity, who is a member of Parliament here in Ottawa. What is the average cost for a home in the City of Ottawa? The Honourable Minister. Uh, Mr. Speaker, my uh, title is the Minister of Tourism and Associate Minister of Finance. I'm sure my honourable colleague across the way knows that. But let me say, Mr. Speaker, 156,000 jobs. Huh? The Honourable Member for Carleton. The uh, Minister of Treasury Board uh, can uh, help uh, by telling us the average cost of a house in uh, the, the nation's capital. The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, I want to say 106% Bruh. of jobs have been recovered since the lowest point of the pandemic. Member for Carleton. What is the uh, average increase in house prices since this government took, house, uh, took office uh, uh, f uh, in 2015? The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, Canada's economy contracted by 17% between February and April 2020, the largest and most sudden contraction in real GDP since the Great Depression, and we're already back. Well, member for Carleton. Just the average house price. The Honourable Minister. 5.5 million Canadians lost their jobs, and they're all back. Member for Carleton. And what would they pay for the average house? The, the minister. In 2020, unemployment rated more than double from a pre-pandemic level of 5.7 percent to a record of 13.7 percent, 6 percent now. Bruh. Member for Carleton. I think there's a problem with the audio in the chamber. <laughs> the question was, what is the average cost of a house in Canada today? The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, our government has made historic investments in housing affordability, and we will continue to do so. The Honourable Member for Carleton. And how affordable are such houses? The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, our government has made historic investments in housing. We will continue oh to do my so God. housing is affordable for all Canadians. Honourable Member for Carleton. If so, how much have house prices uh, increased since this government took office? The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, let's talk about how it's possible for people to afford their houses with good employment. And that's why employment income fell by an unprecedented $28 billion during the percent or during the pandemic. The Honourable Shut Member for Carleton. One last time, in dollars, how much have house prices risen since this government took office? The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, consumer confidence is back. People are back to work. 106% of jobs have been recovered since the lowest part of the pandemic. The Honourable Member for Carleton. How much? Minister. From a steep decline in profits, we're back 66% since the bottom of the pandemic. How much? Member. Minister. Mr. Speaker. The economy is recovering. Does the minister have any idea what it costs for the average person to buy a house in Canada? Does he have any idea, or does he even care? Whoa, calm down, Jamal. Mr. Speaker, the, the minister city helped more than 213,000. Well, I think that the average Canadian can see how much this government knows and cares about the cost uh, of buying a home in this country, uh, which is their, their, their level of care is zero. Oh! I'm going to give him one last chance. Can he tell us what it costs the average Canadian, Canadian to buy the average house in Canada today? How much? The Honourable Minister. Mr. Speaker, the CERB helped nearly 9 million Canadians who lost their jobs when COVID hit, making housing affordable for them. We will continue to do so.